Museum. It's a non-profit corporation. It was formed in 1980. And a lot of local residents, including my mother and my father and some other couples in this town, started it. And uh, the museum was, uh, it uses exhibits to chronicle the transition of this community. Back in the day, this was all timber and a sawmill swampy land of the eastern Arkansas, the sunken lands. So it chronicles the transition of this community from that time until now becoming a farming community. So I just want you to know that it also chronicles all the hill, uh, military history of our residents. We have some outstanding residents. We have a Congressional Medal of Honor winner, James Hendricks. We have a Purple Star Park winner, Mr. J.C. Lewis. We have a Bronze Star winner, Rick Bradford. All those guys from World War II. to our fundraising campaign this community came together like they've always done and we sent out letters to alumni and one of our alumni was Kim Hill Fowler and her husband Chris Fowler and they were gracious to give us a large donation to get our feet back on the ground and because of that it was a catalyst to raise other funds and all of that gave us the opportunity to go to the governor and request additional funds so we want to thank Chris and Kim Hill Fowler and the Today, we also want to recognize because of that, what we had to raise, we were able to sit through our state senator today, Wallace, right here. Your costs are not always what you think they are, and our estimates were definitely low. And because of their efforts, we've been given a great grant, and I'd like them to stand up. All of right here. Through their efforts, all three of these men, Governor Hutchinson granted us $175,000.